morning grade one good morning boys and girls how are you today great job okay today we will start with lesson two in chapter 10 okay it will be about three dimensional shapes like yesterday exactly okay three dimensional shapes and do you remember why did we call them three dimensional shapes because they have three dimensions the first one is width length and the height okay this is the first thing the second thing yesterday we learned two shapes from the three dimensional shapes what they are they were cubes and rectangular prism today we will learn about two more two three dimensional shapes the third one is cones and the fourth one is cylinder okay the cube we studied yesterday we we have learned cubes and rectangular prism okay color prism okay today we will learn cones and cylinders okay when you when you just like um you're wondering that you want an ice cream what do you say i want ice cream cone so the ice cream has a cone down it's the biscuit we all like it mm, delicious this is the other cone okay this cone has point down okay here also point down and it has a curved surface but this cone also has a flat surface we call it face what do we call it face this flat surface is a circle circle okay it can stand in circle it's the base of the circle okay and then this is our cone okay the cone has one face which is circle just one face and it has a curved surface and one point okay great job we have no edges no sides now look at the cylinder the thing that i i love yummy ice cream this is a cylinder and this is another circle down okay it's two circles are facing to each other this side has a circle and the opposite side has another circle okay and there is another example for cylinders like the pepsi can the thing that i hate to drink it's a pepsi can okay the pepsi can also has a circle from up and the circle from down okay i will make it dotted line because it's hiding okay and then this this curved surface right so i have two sides of circles right that both sides are circles so this is the first side and this is the the second face the first face circle and the second face is circle so cylinder not like the cones cylinder has two circles two faces of circle while the cone has just one the base okay so here circle and here circle two great job now this is a cone don't trim don't forget has just one circle as base and one circle base for as a face and here is the cylinder 
cylinder. Okay. And uh, this cylinder has two faces. Both are circles. Great job. Now we're done from page 717. Excellent. You can move to page 718. Excellent. Good job. Now, I want you to all hold your pencils and start together. Cones and cylinders are two more types of three-dimensional shapes. Both shapes have at least one face. Only cones have a vertex. Okay? So where is the face here we said about the cone? We already talked about the cone. The cone has one face only. And this, the small dot, is a vertex. One vertex. So one face and one vertex. One face, one vertex for the cone. Let's go to the cylinder. The cylinder has one circle up, one circle down. So it has two faces. Both are circles. Now, how many vertices do we have? We have no any vertices. Zero vertices. So again, Cone has one vertex, one face, which is the circle one. And cylinder has two faces and no vertices. Great job. Now identify each shape, circle the name, and then write the number of faces and vertices. Let's see, what is this? The shape you can look up. And remember, which shape has two faces up circle down circle what is this shape is it cone no always remember is it like the ice cream cone no but is it like a pepsi can yes it's like a pepsi can so it's cylinder now how many faces for the cylinder one face up, circle, one face down, circle, so two faces. How many vertices? Do you have any corner? No corner for it. All of it curved and all of it circle. No vertices, so it's zero. Let us look at this shape down. You can remember, you can look at it. It's now upside down. It's like an ice cream cone and party hat right this is the circle this is the circle and down it's dot just one dot one corner one corner and it's little bit sharp and point right it's pointed little bit what do we call this shape we call it cone great job how many faces do we have in this cone? I have just one circle, right? It's one face. And how many vertex? How many vertices? It's just one vertex. Great job, boys and girls. Excellent. Now I want you to go to page 719. Try to solve it by yourself. I know you're super smart. And please don't forget to send me your work. First question, identify each shape. Circle the name. Write the number of faces and vertices. The second question, circle the shape of the faces that are part of each object. Remember, we used one shape to make the faces of the cylinder and the cone. Just one shape we used. Remember which shape we used to make the faces. Then circle the object that has the faces shown. I have two faces. I have two faces 
and you need to think a little bit which object which shape has two faces is it the cone or the cylinder great job move to the next page which is page 720 we will just solve one more question together and you will complete the rest alone now we will solve together question number eight which three-dimensional shape has only one face just one face let's draw them this is the first shape we learned two circles one circle up one circle down what is this shape it is a cylinder cylinder okay then what is the other shape we learned a circle from down and a cone from up it's a pointed up one and one face down just to one face so the cone has only one face thank you so much for following please complete the rest alone and send me your work love you all